In this video, I'm going to show you how to restore lost Bitcoin wallet pin code using that file and hashcat. Let's begin. Okay, so in order to get a wallet that file, I found this a website called Bitcoin Wallet. The probably it's uh, scammers that try to sell apparently <laughs> wallets with tens of thousand bitcoins that lost the key but it's probably a scam it's very easy to generate those that file but there is a section for free wallets so let's choose the the 70,000 uh, bitcoins wallet that we get for free let's download it it's probably a scam don't don't tempt to buy those wallets it's bullshit okay so we have the file in the download folder let's download hashcat we need to upload the repository server if you have Kali or already installed hashcat just ignore it I will download a couple of uh, packages. Now we will git clone the um, hashcat. Let's compile it with the make command and install. That's it. We have hashcat. And now I will uh, download a couple of more packages because I'm going to install John the Stripper in order to use one of the scripts. To extract the hash value from the that file, uh, we clone the John the Reaper, and let's compile it, configure it, and install it. Okay, so John is up. We can see that we're gonna use yeah under the round folder, Bitcoin to John script. I forgot we need to also install Python in order to use it. So let's download Python. Now let's run the script uh, under the John the Ripper slash run folder in order to extract the hash value from the dot file. So we got it. You can uh, open uh, any text editor and post hash value to a file name or just dump it with a greater than sign. In this case, I dumped it to the file called bitcoinwallet.hash at the desktop. Let's move this file to the hashcap folder. It'll be easier to work with that. As you can see, we have the hash in the hashcat file folder. There is another easiest way to do that. You can just Google Bitcoin to John and do it online, but it's less private. So maybe someone can steal your file and hashes. But you can see it's uh, the same hash, the same hash value okay let's continue now we're gonna um, um, run the command for the attack uh, sudo hashcat dash a3 for boot force minus m and the ha hash value hash type in this case 11300 for bitcoin the file the hash file location and as you can see i choose a digit mask with small a letter it means that it will check all the options small letter apple case letter numbers and symbols and then incremental will increment every time with w one digit so as you can see start with one digit then two digit then three digit and you can see at the bottom the the candidate combination is trying and okay three digits gonna try like gonna take like 25 minutes but that's it anyway you got the point thank you very much and have a nice day cheers